Good Friday morning, church family. Well, Pastor. In the spring break. Yeah, did you have a good one? Had a good one. Did you? I did. Enjoyed being away, but it's good to be back. Looking forward to Sunday. Sunday morning is coming. 9 a.m. connect groups all ages from preschool Mm. all the way to senior adults. If you're not connected in a small group Bible study, maybe you've been visiting with us and you've not connected there. Get connected this week. Just come to the steeple entrance just a few minutes early. That's right. right. They'll get you connected. And uh, we love to see those people get connected. Something I love to see. uh, 8.15 on Sunday mornings, we have a prayer time in the worship center from 8.15 to 8.30. When 8.30 is over, we kind of fellowship together and talk together and then we go greet people. It is a joy to see people coming in the doors of our facility on Sunday morning about 8.45 to 9 o'clock. Smiles on their faces, being greeted by people, going to a connect group and sharing life with people and studying God's Word. You can be a part of that as well. We hope you'll join us on Sunday morning. And we don't want to forget, I don't know that we've mentioned that here, we want to invite you to our prayer time at 8.15 on Sunday morning. We'd love to have you at that. That's open to our our entire church, so we'd love to have you at that. Uh, So immediately following that prayer time is Connect Hour. Then following that at 10.30, is our worship service. Where are we headed this week? Yeah, this week back in person again. We're back in Ruth chapter two, Bo yeah. Knows. You remember that commercial, <laughs> Bo Jackson? He knew everything. He did. But uh, we're gonna be introduced to a guy in Ruth chapter two by the name of Boaz, a significant person in the story of redemption. You don't wanna miss that. We're gonna talk a lot about grace on Sunday morning. That's a great hymn, Amazing Grace, but it's a great subject to talk about. So uh, Bo Knows coming up in Ruth two. Those who worship online, you're gonna be able to see the message from our missions pastor preached a great word on missions and our mission strategy on Sunday talking about making the unknown God known Jason Johnson did that so we want you to watch that online share it with some other people invite people to worship with you as well again thank you for giving week in and week out your tithes and offerings making a difference that's why we can do missions the way we do is because you give but you'll mark again on this Friday a number of things coming up we want to kind of be rapid fire like we were last week time change coming up this Sunday March the 12th, mm. springing forward. Make yeah. sure you're ready. Lose Make sure you're sleep. here. That's right. You're going to lose an hour, yeah. but we're going to gain some daylight. I like that time. I do too. I love I that love time. I love the longer here. daylight. That's, That's right. a great thing. That's right. And then coming up on March 15th, Wednesday night, is going to be our Chick-fil-A dinner. What time does that start and where is that at for that folks? That starts 4.30 uh, to 6. It's in our fellowship hall. That's our regular Wednesday night meal. We're just going to have Chick-fil-A that night. Mm. That'll be a great time together, so don't miss that. And then March 19th is our gospel conversation training. It's from noon to 4 o'clock. It's going to be in the original fellowship hall area. One of the things we want to equip you in as we talk about, you know, worship God, love people, share Jesus, make disciples. How do you share Jesus? Mm. How do you take an everyday conversation, turn it into a gospel conversation? We'll train you how to do that on Sunday, March the 19th. You can sign up and be a part of that. Also, John Mark, prayer is vital to our church. March 20th through the 26th is an important date on a prayer event for us. We're going to do a week of prayer and Mm -hmm. fasting. Uh, You'll want to be here at noon. That's going to start off in our Grace Worship Center. Uh, So we did that last week. We did. I mean, last Last year year we did an emphasis on that. Very effective. It is, it is. And I'm looking forward to something maybe a little different this year. So uh, I'm I'm, I'm looking forward to it. It's going to be good. I hope you'll participate with us. So from noon to 1245, beginning March 20th. Also on March 30th, 1130, in the Fellowship Hall, Dr. Kevin Ezell, president of the North American Mission Board, is going to be with us that day. We'll serve Chick-fil-A for lunch, no cost to you. We do ask you to sign up, so we want to make sure we got enough box meals here for folks from Chick-fil-A. Dr. Ezell is going to talk about the North American Mission Board. He'll talk about the Annie Armstrong Easter offering. By the way, our goal is $30,000 for that offering. And he's also going to talk about leadership, and I suspect he'll share a joke or two <laughs> as well. It'll be fun. We don't want you to miss that so you can sign up and uh, be a part of that luncheon and then john mark coming up on sunday april the 9th resurrection sunday that's easter sunday yeah. that's the super bowl for for it all is. of us it that is. are in the faith uh so that's a time where people are mm. open to invitations and a lot of people will just decide to go to church right. that day yeah uh so think about that person that uh yeah. that's in your family that's a friend that's a neighbor uh that's a co-worker somebody that you know needs needs a closer walk with That's Jesus right. or needs Jesus maybe yes, yeah. uh, uh, to give salvation to them if they accept that free gift. So. We, we want you to make sure that you're thinking about those people because that's an important day for us. Yeah. And, more, and more just, just so you'll invite. know as well, you think about we're going to invite them. We're going to be doing some very inspiring music oh, you yeah. know, Easter Sunday. Yeah. 
but also we're going to be in a series over Easter Sunday on heaven. Mm. And I've already had people talking about that series, and we're going to talk about heaven that day. How do you go to heaven? So it'd be a great opportunity for you to invite some people to join you that day. But John Mark, on this Friday morning, this is amazing grace. I'm, I'm just overwhelmed at the goodness and the grace of God mm. in life. We've, you and I wouldn't be here without that. Not a and we say that a lot, and many That's of right. you wouldn't be where you are That's without right. the grace of God. So let's turn our hearts and minds now to Jesus and thank him for that amazing mm. grace. And we'll see you all Sunday. Worthy is the king who conquered